Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to add or create a watermark in your Epson printer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu and search for control panel. Best results should come back with control panel. Go ahead and open that up. Set your view by to large icons up at the top right. And then select devices and printers. Select the printers and scanners button, and then locate the Epson printer in here. Just left click on it, and then go down and select printing preferences. Select the more options tab, and then there should be a watermark features button. Open that up, and now you can add watermarks by just clicking the drop down here and selecting different watermark options. So there's certain words you could use. You can also select the Add Delete option here to add a custom defined text. If you want to delete a certain word in here, you could put Custom Watermark, for example. And you can select Save, and then OK. So pretty cool on that. And you can select the Settings option then to then do further customizations, as well as changing the color of the watermark. The density, so how dark it is, I guess more so do the opacity, as well as the position on the page, up and down, left and right. If you want to layer it in front or behind text, you can do that as well. Or if you want to adjust the angle of the watermark, you can do that as well. And you can also just print on the first page only, if that is your choice for setting the watermark. And then once you're done with any of your changes or customizations, select OK, and then OK again. And that's pretty much it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.